good morning to all of you dear students as we have discussed over uh, our india con uh, our country india so today we are discussing about physical division so basically physical division like you know the physical it means which is uh, in uh, you know you will see that mountain plateau plains coast and rivers iceland standing in uh, sentinels in north are the lofty snow capped himalayas so basically this is called you know okay, the uh, physical division so this is himalaya as you know, if you know the himalaya you know, it is uh, the um, <coughs> comes from two word him than ale him it means you know okay, the abode of snow and the ale it means anghar it means home so basically the himalayas mountains are divided into three main parallel ranges so there are three ranges so the north most range is great himalaya okay at first please um, learn this one ki to north most north most hai, that we call great himalaya or himadri and the world highest peak of uh, are located in these ranges okay after middle himalaya all himanchal that we lies to the south of himadri so basically this is lies to the south of himadri and yeah? then not north in a country south of himadri okay it is great himalaya Achha, many popular hills station are situated uh, here find out the names of uh, five hill stations the Siwalik is the southernmost range so Siwalik is the southernmost range is ki. Achha, after we will see ki the north, uh, northern Indian plains lie to the south of the Himalayas they are generally level and flat so these are formed by alluvial deposit laid down by the rivers tributaries okay river uh, and the indus the ganga the brahmaputra and their tributaries so basically this is the northern indian plain it is very fertile land you know okay, there is a fertile land because you know it, uh, as we told that uh, erosion first is erosion and second is deposition so basically this is deposition which is carried by the um, by the uh, rivers and other things uh, like wind to uh you know get the ganga Bamputa river and their tributaries that we you know keep see is it a uh <coughs> keep provided fertile land for cultivation okay so it is the western part of india like the great indian desert so you will see that ki uh, raisan wale area pe that it there is a great indian uh, desert in a western part okay this is east and this is west so this is western part mein yaha par uh, that this is the Indian uh, India ka jo, this is map okay Isko waise bana raho. okay so this is you know ki western part may be endangered and to the south of northern plains in the peninsula plateau it is triangular in shape so basically peninsula jo plateau hai it is triangular in shape triangular hai shape mein and uh, the relief is highly uneven is the this is a region with uh, numerous hill ranges and valleys so Ravali hills one of the oldest ranges in the, of the world so border it on the northwest side so the Vindhya and the Satpura Vindhya or Satpura these are the important ranges of uh, you know the uh, important ranges of Aravalli hills one of the oldest ranges and the rivers Narmada and Tapi flow through these ranges so basically to Narmada hai or the Tapi hai Vindhya or Satpura se kya hoti hai jati hai Theek hai please uh, learn this one ki Vindhya or Satpura se jati hai ok wait on ok so this is Tapi and uh, Narmada after you will see ki these are west flowing rivers that drain into the Arabian Sea the western ghat or Sayadri border the plate in the west and the eastern ghat provided the eastern boundary so basically this is a western ghat the western hai theek hai western ghat hai yahan par sayadri hai border of the plateau in the west and the eastern ghat aur the eastern ghat hai that you will see diye hai eastern ghat yahan ko eastern ghat hai yahan ko western ghat hai theek hai so this is provided the eastern boundary while the western ghat are almost continuous the eastern ghats are broken and uneven so the plateau is rich in minerals like coal and iron ore so basically this is important uh, this is the important thing ki the western ghat where is the sayadri border plateau in the west and eastern ghat provides the eastern boundary so while 
you will see ki western ghat are almost continuous the eastern ghat are broken and uneven eastern ghat jo hai wo broken hai aur uneven hai okay and the western ghat jo hai wo continuous hai so this is one of the plate which rich is mineral like coal and iron ore main jo hai ye jo plate us hain wahan par ye bahut zyada kya hai you will see ki this plate is rich minerals that we have find okay so this is the end of the video please read this uh, physical division as i told you okay okay after we will discuss about okay um, we will discuss about the terms of an uh, okay we will uh, uh, see the map and we will discuss about after iceland and uh, other uh, one to uh, or uh, mahadevi godavari and krishna kaveri rivers okay and the uh, coastal plains what we have so i will send uh, you in a next video okay so tab tak ke liye uh, see the video and uh, please read the chapters thoroughly as i told you and if you have any problem if you have any uh, you know ki uh, if you have any query so you can ask me anytime okay so goodbye have a good day to all of you